Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and you will learn health and medicine through my videos. Please hit like and subscribe and please hit the notification bell so that you don't miss my videos. Circulatory system includes your heart and it also includes the blood vessel Circulatory system also includes artery, and veins. Arteries are blood vessels that carry the blood away from the heart, whereas veins are the blood vessels that carry the blood towards the heart. The diameter of the lumen in arteries is smaller whereas in veins the lumen is larger. In arteries the middle layer is made up of smooth muscles which is thicker whereas in veins the smooth muscle is thinner. Veins also have walls which prevents the backflow of blood whereas arteries don't have any walls. Blood pressure in arteries is greater as compared to veins. Both arteries and veins are made up of three layers. Outer layer is tunica adventitia, middle layer is tunica media and the innermost layer is tunica interna. Tunica media is made up of smooth muscles, tunica interna is made up of endothelial cells and tunica adventitia is made up of collagen which contains elastic tissue. Average weight of heart in females is around 250 grams whereas in males it is 310 grams. Heart is present between the lungs in a space called mediastinum. Heart is enclosed within the thoracic cavity formed by the thoracic cage. The apex of heart is at the level of fifth intercostal space and the base of heart is present at around the second ribs. The relation of heart with other anatomical structures. Anterior to the heart you have your sternum and ribs. Posteriorly, you have your trachea and esophagus. This is the visual representation of the heart laterally and superiorly. As you can see here, Superiorly, you have your blood vessels like aorta and pulmonary artery and pulmonary veins. Inferiorly, you have your diaphragm which is attached to lungs with the help of central tendon. Lateral to your heart, you have your right and left lungs. The heart comprises of three layers. The innermost layer is endocardium. The middle layer is made up of muscular layer known as myocardium. The outer fibrous layer is the pericardium. Pericardium outer layer is parietal pericardium and inner layer is visceral pericardium and in the middle you have your pericardial sac. This was all about the brief introduction regarding the circulatory system. In next video, we will cover the anatomical structures in detail. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do it now and click the notification bell so that you don't miss out on my videos.